Can you show me? Can you? Can you? <laughs> hello? Yeah, hello, uh, Christian Prince. Hey, this my friend. Boss. Hey, I call boss, you on Monday, boss. and ever since I'm being blocked. Uh, my friend, if you are blocked, you will not be able to call me. What did I do wrong? I mean, can't you take criticism? My friend, if you are blocked, you will not be able to call me, so don't lie. No, no, I no, no. This is my daughter's account I'm using. Ah, I'm okay. Maybe maybe you said something wrong. I don't I don't remember you. Maybe you said are you the one who said the F word the, the, the days ago? Oh no, no, I would never say that. I okay, go ahead. What do you want to say? I would say that to you, you are a hypocrite and I you are a, I'm gonna expose you as a liar. So All I, was, right. I was blocked. Okay. I thought you have a thicker skin than that. My friend, my friend, my friend. Let us go to you. business. Let us go to business. Expose me. Go ahead. Well, I, as you were saying, I just saw so I come down to your level now. Okay. To debate with you, uh, just for the better, um, for the betterment of some people. Mm -hmm. And I am a layman. I told you before, but uh, as I said uh, last time, I want to expose your lies if you allow me. <laughs> Is that all right with you? Go ahead. I'm listening. Okay. Now, um, I heard you talking to somebody mm. um, a few weeks back. Mm -hmm. And there was a Muslim a guy who became converted to Christianity, mm -hmm. and uh, I feel very sorry for him. Okay. Um, and you actually um, uh, tricked him with the hadith, weak hadith, okay. and then you made a lie on that hadith. So I want to know if I'm wrong, correct me. Mm -hmm. The hadith is regarding 72 companions you're going to have when you're going to paradise, mm -hmm. and well, you're going to have eternal, um, um, you know, uh, what do you call it? Uh, you know, you know, your private part will be uh, never go down. Always right, it will never, it will never go limp. Yeah, that's right. That's you know that that's a weak hadith in Ibn Ibn Majah. You know that. Okay. Do you know that weak hadith yes. is accepted? Yes or no? Uh, not always. No. If weak is backed by uh, authentic, yes. Weak mm. by itself is can, you can. How it can use. be weak uh, and it's backed by authentic? Because if it's backed by authentic, then we have the authentic. We do not need the weak. No, but that's why week is there. So mm. if there's authentic there, so you can back it up and you can just leave it there. But okay, my friend, my friend, my friend, my friend. If this mm -hmm. hadith, are you saying this hadith is totally rejected? Uh, I wasn't saying that. Let me finish what I'm going to say, please. Mm. Uh, let's say for the sake of argument, mm. this hadith is authentic. Mm. Yes, but the problem is not there. Problem is further that you lied. And what you said to that guy, uh, you said, uh, you know, seventy women will come from hell and two from the hoodies. Mm. He said, yes. Mm. You said, do you know what kind of a women go to hell? Mm. And he said, very bad women. Mm. And then you say, no, prostitutes mm. are in hell. Mm. So 70 prostitutes will come mm. in a paradise. So okay. you can have a lot of sex because they're expert on that. All right. Now, my question to you is, you're supposed to be a learned man, mm. not ignorant. Mm. Are every woman, according to Islam, who are in hell, are they prostitutes? But your Quran, your verse, sorry, here, the Hadith described that they are special women. Do you see that or no? Uh, special in what? They have nice breasts and nice vagina. Mm, is that Hadith say, saying that? It says that in front of you. Who okay. will have so, desirable front passages? Uh, so uh, good women do not have desirable uh, breasts. Okay, thank you very much. So no, why you're... Hold, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What kind of a qualification those women they have to go out of heaven? What do you mean, go out? Did your no, prophet yeah. mention that those are women who they are good? Obviously, they are in hell. They are in hell for what they, reason? They are in hell for what reason? Never, no, you say go out of heaven. What do you My mean? My friend, they were, they uh, go out, go out of hell to heaven. What is the uh, qualification made them go out of hell to go to heaven? Uh, what are the qualifications? Let's let's teach us then. What was the qualification? They were in hell. Well, here we go. Here we go. You see, the same qualification. Obviously, the one who take them to hell is the same qualification taking them from heaven, from from uh, from hell. Because if you're a prophet, describe that those women, nothing about them is good, except they have a nice breast and nice vagina. Then that is mean. This is what oh. they have in earth, and this is what they were using. Otherwise, explain kidding? to me. It could prove me wrong. Prove me wrong are that you, those women, you, those women are, are good you, women. Prove to me that no, they are no, good no. women. No, no, no. Listen, uh, CP, you can't play these games with me. You know what? Hmm. I am a layman, but I'm from Speaker's Corner as well. A, a real layman. Hmm. And you asking for these guys, Shamsi and Hijab, hmm. who can really, really can crush you in minutes. Hmm. But if, you, if you're controlling it, of course they can't, like you're controlling everybody. And, and this is a silly argument. You cannot do that to me. You know, I, I want to read that hadith, yeah? Read you're putting <laughs> your words into hadith, and that's exactly what you do all the time. You put a little bit of your words to twist things. We are talking about the women of hell. When this hadith say they're going to come. Why they are in hell? 
Why are they R in hell? Okay, tell me one thing. I'm uh, let's say I'm not attacking you or an idea. Let's say there's a very decent Christian woman, very decent Christian woman, go to church, they do a very good thing, or very good Hindu woman. Mm. If that woman is a very good Hindu woman, very a very pious mm. Hindu woman, according to Islam, she's going to go hell. You agree? No, no. A good pious Hindu woman, according to Islam, is not going to go hell. Prove, give me a proof. Show me a proof. Well, you know, you mentioned the Christian too, because the Christian, according yes, to Christian your prophet, and Hindu, I say your, Hindu as well. Your prophet, your prophet, he lied once. He said. That the Christians and the Jews and the Savian, who they are the same as other religion, worship stars, they will go to heaven. Okay, what that means? That's mean there's many people who will go to heaven. Uh, so they, you know there were Christians and Jews and Sabians they lived before Muhammad Sallallahu But he was not talking about people who lived before. He was talking about those who believe in Allah and the last messengers and etc. and the Jews and the Christians and the Savian. He was speaking in the moment. Uh, right. I I don't I don't I don't think he was talking about the present as he's talking about the people of uh, Jews Christians Sabians. my friend he was talking to people who they are when you say he, he didn't say the, the Jews who pass away he didn't say the Christian okay. who pass away huh? okay. he said okay. the Jews the Jews when I say the Christian the Hindus the Buddhas the atheist they will go to heaven and they have no worry it's mean I'm talking yeah, about yeah, people who they are yeah. will be in the moment look you you have all the details with you can you can you provide that what is the number of the hadith let's let's have a read because you know what what i learned from you only in two weeks i learned from you you twist words what you hadith you are talking about what hadith what you, what whatever you saying that these people are going to go say oh sorry quranic verse with the quranic verse sorry yeah, okay. said, what quranic verse is that let's read it and anyway okay. That is beside the point. I will deal with this point. Seriously, wallahi, I will deal with this Sir, point. I like it, wallahi. Go ahead. Well, okay. You don't want me to say wallahi? Okay. I, 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 it's funny it's because, you are using, because you are using the name of your God in vain. Wallahi. Uh, I apologize. See, there we go. I apologize. Okay, thanks for correcting Chapter 2, verse number okay. 62. Chapter 2, verse number 62. But I say we will deal with it. But first I deal with, let's say, the Hindu pious woman. Are they going to go hell according to Islam or not? They will go to hell? According to Islam, the good, pious Hindu woman is going to go hell, or yes or no? Nothing mentioned in the Quran that they will go to, to, uh, to so hell. So uh, use, use your imagination then. Well, if she you is, a, maybe, I don't know, maybe, maybe if she have a nice vagina, she will go to heaven, as you see. <laughs> Prove me uh, wrong. Just... Prove me wrong. How, why, your God never mentioned the Hindus. <laughs> Did your God Allah mention? Did your God Allah mention the Hindus or the Buddha? Guys, okay, I'm gonna speak on your behalf. Guys, you guys know that he's busted. That's why you couldn't answer that. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, 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 you answer it. Prove it to me. Here we go. Get me busted. Where in the Quran your God Allah spoke against the Hindus and the Buddha? Something that's so obvious that. Uh, what do you mean so obvious? Why, why Muhammad? Why Muhammad? He think the whole world is Jews and Christians. Okay. Why Muhammad? He think. Why Muhammad? He think all the world is Jews and Christians, or they are the same as Quraysh? Quran doesn't even mention the Scientologist people where they're going to go. So why he did not mention? Why he did not mention? Because you're probably my friend. The Quran do not even know what the Christian believe. The Quran believe that the Trinity is the is Mary and Jesus and Allah. Okay, are the Hindus are polytheists or not? My friend, is that true? That that the Christians believe that Mary and Allah and Jesus is the Trinity? Uh, where did the Quran says that that's the Trinity? Where the Quran says. Yeah, this is the Trinity. I know what verse you're using. I think you, you say <laughs> chapter five, verse one seventy one. Okay, yeah? uh, my friend, my friend. Yes. Uh, show me the verse in the Quran speaking about the Trinity the correct way. Uh, Quran uh, mentioning Trinity the correct way. Why Quran mm. has to mention it? Because the Quran is mentioned the Trinity already. Uh, where is it? The word Trinity mentioned. Yes, uh, Salasa. But mm. where where the Quran says that Mary, Jesus, and God is a Trinity. So are you where saying to me that the Quran? Yes. Never say that. Quran never defines Trinity uh, as you are saying it. Uh, Mary, Jesus, and uh, God is Trinity. Quran never say that. Read the verse. Okay. I'm here. Bust me. Okay. Here we go. Yeah. Read the verse. Wa qala Allahu ya Isa ibn Maryam, anta qulta lil nas, az nas attakhiduni wa ummi ilahin min duni Allah. Chapter five, verse one sixteen. One chapter five, verse one sixteen. One second. Mm -hmm. Sorry, um, I thought it was chapter four. Uh, one sixteen. Let's read it. Mm -hmm. um, so you read in Arabic, okay, for the benefit of people. Can I read in English? Sure. <clears throat> and imagine when thereafter Allah will say, Jesus, son of Mary, peace be upon them. Mm -hmm. Did you say to people, take me and my mother for God beside Allah? Where does it say it's Trinity? Okay, let us see, guys. He did not see it yet. It says, no, I did. it says, okay, it says, okay, it says, take me, me, Jesus, this is one. Yeah. And then take Mary, 
yeah. this is second and then beside Allah this is the third yeah <laughs> so there's three <laughs> no hang on a minute Every, when when God when God says some people are three believing in three gods or four, four gods my this friend, my friend, this you said to me, not... you said to me, where in the Quran it says, and get me busted, right? You are the one who said that to me. It says yeah, in the yeah, front yeah. of you, it says in the front of you that he is saying to Jesus, Did you say to worship me and my mother beside me? Which means we have a three to worship now. So Allah, well, Allah is a question what here is a question the Trinity, and you got busted, my friend. Uh, so well, in your in your view, but you think your this is your implication. Well, you ex said, explain Allah. to me, explain to me I, beside me. So beside who they are worshiping two? They are worshiping two beside chance. Allah. Who is the two? Mary and Jesus. <laughs> Give me a chance. Okay. Okay. Uh, so you are denying that there are people ever never uh, worship Mary. My friend, I never heard of any, but even if there is. Your God is speaking about the Christians. All of them, they worship Mary, and your God never mentioned uh, any other Trinity except this uh, one. No, 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 no. No. First of all, you didn't. You didn't say it's all of the Christians. No, it says. Allah, it says. Allah it says. Asking, no, it says. It says. It says. It says. Let me get you busted again. You see, here we are here to get the Abdul busted. I'm. I'm. I'm very happy that you are a speaker corner because look like uh, all of you are well, the same. Yeah, I'm listen, lame, listen, man. listen, 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 listen. Yeah, okay. I'm Let us see. Mm -hmm. All the Christians. When when you when your God he speak about the Christian what he called them? Uh, uh, Nasara. Nasara. What the Nasara believe? Uh, you trying to put me in your box? I'm asking you what the what 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 the Nasara believe according to the Quran. Nasaras, Nasaras have many different beliefs. They are not one single. No, my reason. so that, that's mean there's a mistake in the Quran because the, the Quran says the Nasara believe. The Nasara believe when when every there is many group of Nasara then you cannot call them Nasara then we should call them maybe Jehovah's Witnesses maybe we should call them Mormon. As long as long you call Catholic, them Nasara, my friend, my friend, all uh, all of those, all of those, you see, this is your problem in your, your, your religion. If your God, he know, he's aware of what's happening, he should not call all by, by one name because they are not Nasara anymore. Because if somebody is Jehovah's Witnesses, he's not Nasara. If somebody is a Mormon, he's not Nasara. If somebody, according to you, is a Catholic, he's not Nasara. If someone is a Protestant, he's not Nasara. So where is the Nasara? Uh, Catholics are Nasara, yes, they are. I'm asking you, where is the Nasara? Who are the Nasara? Cat I'm asking Catholics. you now. I'm asking you, my friend. Who is the I'm Nasara? Who is the I'm Nasara? Who is the Nasara? I'm telling you. Hmm. Are you Christian? Yes. Are Catholics Christian? I am none of those denomination. No, no. But are Catholics Christian? Yes. So are uh, Jehovah Witness Christian? No. But they say they are. No. But they say they are. No, Jehovah's Witnesses and believe the same as Islam. They are. They believe in there is many gods. Like you, so they are pagans. I, I, used to, I used to talk to Jehovah's Witnesses. My friend, my friend, no, I mean, no, don't lie, don't lie. Jehovah's Witnesses are false cult like your prophet. Now answer no, me. Not, Where, who is the Nasara true. according to your prophet? The Nasara according to your prophet is one exist religion. All of them are the same and Yahud. So he called the religion two names, Yahud and Nasara. If if there the, if there is one more, then name it. Obviously, those are not Nasara. Either the Nasara is the either the Nasara is us who believe in Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Or Nasara is the one who believe in Mary and Jesus and Allah. You have to admit. No, 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 no. It's not saying that. So where is, where is the ones? What is the name? Uh, why your God is not naming those who believe in Mary, as you said? You said there is a certain sect, and you are the one who said Nasara is the Catholic. Okay, no problem. Nasara is the Protestant. No problem. Orthodox are Nasara. No problem. Okay. Who are they? The sect which is believe in Mary and Jesus and Allah as God. CP. I don't even, I don't know you too well, so I don't want to make judgment. Are you a just man? You you believe in justice. I'm listening, my friend. Uh, go ahead. I, I hope you believe in justice. My friend, so go, ahead, go ahead. Justice, do you believe in justice? Yourself. Do you believe in justice? Well, I, oh, 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 well, I'm not gonna talk a lie. So yes, I do. No, I you do, don't. Actually, no, just, you don't. Your justice, prophet he said, your prophet justice. he said, if a Muslim kill a Muslim, he will be killed. If he kill non-Muslim, he paid the half of the blood. What justice, justice is that? Is, Muhammad justice. he said, Muhammad he said, no Muslim will be killed for killing an unbeliever. What justice? Don't talk about justice. You are not a person justice of justice. Justice is the most beautiful thing. You in don't believe Islam. in justice. Is that justice that you, Allah if, 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 just. if you murder, answer me then. Is it justice if I murder a Muslim, I will be killed? Because I'm a Muslim, I kill the Muslim. But if I what murder a Christian, the punishment is not death for me? What are you quoting? The Hadith. Okay. You, uh, so which is, which is my authority, Quran or Hadith? Well, is are you going to say to me it's weak? <laughs> no, no, which is my authority, Quran or Hadith? Which comes first? Bo Come on, my friend, both of them, because because even Hadith is equal to the Quran. 
if I if I quote you Quran and you quote me Hadith, okay, which, which one quote me okay, quote me a Hadith, quote me a Quran says that a Muslim if he killed them if he killed a Christian, he would be killed for killing a Christian. I'm going to quote you a verse in the Quran, mm. and then you can bring the Hadith and we see we analyze. Yeah, we can, we can go. Over. Let us finish this one first. Now go ahead. Who are the Nasara? Oh. Who are the Nasara? Which the, the 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 Quran is speaking about? Uh, well, look. First of all, this verse I'm reading again. Mm -hmm. And it doesn't you mention the word Nasara? Do you know that the word you go? My friend, words. my friend, aren't you the one who say that we go to the interpretation? Uh, why you always rely? Do you think in interpretation is infallible? My friend, my friend. Okay, hold on. Do the chapter five mention the Nasara? Yes or no? Chapter five, one, one six. This verse we are talking about. My this friend, verse, does some it doesn't matter. No, this verse, this yeah, verse, this matter. verse is about what? This verse is about what? I tell you what. If this word word says, mm. "Oh, you Nasara, do you worship Jesus, Mary, and Allah?" Then I you have a point. It doesn't say that. It says, "My Allah friend, will ask my, my, my friend, my friend, my friend, Allah will ask Jesus." My friend, my, my friend, you, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. It's a different thing altogether. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. When you understand the verse, you as a Muslim, you say you are a speaker corner. How you understand the verse? Uh, how I understand the verse? Uh -huh. Like what is your guidance? You telling me every single verse I have to go to interpretation. So what do you do? Every single... What do you do? You do not need interpretation. You are you are the Prophet Muhammad, and you know everything. Okay, I'll tell you what. When mm. I read this verse, chapter mm. five, verse uh, mm. eight, O oh, you who believe, mm. stand out firmly for Allah mm. as witnesses to fair dealing, mm. and let not your hatred of others. To mm. you, make you swerve to to wrong and depart from justice. Mm. Be just. Mm. That is next to piety and fear Allah. For Allah is well acquainted with all that you do. Chapter five, verse eight. Do I need a commentary from some scholar? What it means? You need to. You need. Why do I need that? Okay, let me do let, me, let me ask you. Let me ask you. Can we read the verse verse before and verse after in the same chapter we are reading from? Uh, chapter five, verse uh, seven and nine. You want me to read? No, we are reading chapter the where it says where it says. That they took his mother, Jesus. Uh, Allah is asking Jesus, "Did you yeah. take? Did you take? Did you tell your people to worship you and your mother?" That's right. Okay. Beside Allah, I, can we yeah. read verses after it, please, so we can see Allah is talking about who? About who? After? Yes. Okay. You can take take the verse after. Mm -hmm. um, I said to them nothing except what you commanded me. Okay. That is, I'm reading Maududi's translation, so it might be slightly <coughs> different than yours. Mm. Serve Allah, my Lord, and your Lord. Mm. I watched over them as long I remained among them. Mm. And when you did recall me, mm. then you yourself became the watcher over them. Mm. Indeed, you are witness over everything. Mm. Mm -hmm. Yes, explain what you, what's your point here. What is the verse number 18? Oh, well, you want me to read two, two verses? Yeah. Okay, all right. Uh, if you chastise them, they are your servants, and if you forgive them, you are the Almighty. Your are you, my friend, what are you reading? Uh, chapter 5, verse 118. What 118? You gave me 116, then I read 117 and 118. Ah, sorry, sorry, 116. I wanted to, I want you to go to beginning to introduce to you a chapter of Al Maida speaking about who? A chapter of Al Maida is speaking about the Nasara. Is that correct? All of it, all of it. This is why it's called. This is why it's called. You see, when we speak about Al Maida, there's nothing in the Quran is speaking only about one topic because your prophet he have a flight of thought. So sometimes he speak about tomato, sometimes he talk about about zucchini. But this is not the question. The Maida is about what? Is about those who follow Jesus. This is why it's called Al Maida because Jesus he made a miracle. It's called the miracle of the Maida. Is that correct? I believe so. Yes. All right. He did. So in the beginning of the chapter is speaking you know what, you know in the, the, in the beginning. In the beginning of the chapter is giving us definition. Allah speaking about who. So here we will find that the Quran divide give us definition about he's talking about who he's talking about the people of the book, and then when he mentioned always the Nasara, he mentioned specifically the Christian. When he mentioned uh, when I talk about both of them, he say Ahlul Kitab, people of the book. It can be the Christian, it can be the Jews. But when he mentioned the word Nasara. It's always to be have to be about the Christian. So now, That's right. nowhere That's in the right. Quran, nowhere in the Quran, mention any other name of any other belief except the Nasara. Do you agree uh, about the Christians? If there's other name for those you call them Christians, Nasara for me, but they are not, they are not Christians. Nasara are not Christians. Well, Nasara is from Nazarene, from Nazareth. Here we go. See, Nazareth. this is why I say they are not Christians. Those are people who they are. 
they 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 are like Jehovah's Witnesses. They are cult. And Muhammad he thought that those are the Christians. Those are the Nasara. This is the only Nasara he knew. This is why he thought that those are the Nasara who believe in Mary and believe in Jesus and believe in Allah. And that make him believe that this is the Trinity of who, who, who called them Nasara as a Christians. But the fact Nasara is not exist. Yeah, but that's not the point. You know, this is the point. point. This is the point. Why your God did not mention? Okay, let us say, let us say for the sake of argument, as long your God, he mentioned that there is a group of people they worship Mary. Are they the minority or the majority? Group of people who mention Mary. Well, listen, you put in the words in, uh, again in the Quran. What do you mean? You know, Allah is not saying that there are people worshiping. Listen to this. Word yes, it says clear. that. It says that. It says that. It says that. It says that. It says. No, no, no. He, he said. Know, but, but, he but said to Jesus, to are, "Did you? Are you the one who said to them, worship your mother?" Correct. Did you say to people, Allah is questioning yes. okay. Jesus? Okay. No, no problem. So Allah he's saying, Jesus. your Did God you claim, your God claim that those who they are Nasara, they worship Mary. You say you still you adding things into this is the problem. You just my friend. Then who are the Nasara? Explain to me who are the one. What is the name of this religion? They worship Mary as God. Look at the, well. You, we know the Catholics worship Mary. They that's false. Mary. That's false. That's a big fat lie. That's a big they fat lie. Mary. Okay, here they we go. A challenge between me and you. A challenge between me and you to show yeah. me one Catholic in the world worship Mary and consider her as God. Yeah. No, no, no. What is what, what is worship? My friend, don't what? lie. Don't lie. So what is it says worship. Worship is to take it as God. Do you see the Quran? Read, read with me. Read with me. The Quran says, "Take my mother as God." Do you see it? Okay. Jesus okay. I'm, I'm read again. Beside Allah, mm -hmm. uh, uh, take my mother for God. Beside Allah. Okay. See what? What is okay? What is God? In Islam, what what people do to God? My they friend, don't tell me what is God. Have, don't don't go. I mean, what, what a game you are playing. God they is God. Them. God is God. So the Quran claim that there's in Christianity, in Christianity, those who they are Nasara, they worship three gods. One, his name is Isa. One, his name is Mary, and one, his name is Allah. Okay, I will prove it to you from the Quran. Okay, mm -hmm. that the Allah, the all the, the pagans used to believe in gods. Whoever they worship, that is their gods. So worship means when you're asking somebody help. So what does that you mean? Ask my friend asking somebody help that's that's worship my you, friend you, my friend my friend praise, don't praise don't fool don't fool yourself don't fool yourself don't fool yourself because anyone ask somebody for help that will make him god that's mean muhammad is god because the quran and the hadith confirm that your prophet will intercede for you so you uh, are saying now you are confirming that wait, muhammad wait, is god verse? because your god he said your god muhammad, your god muhammad he said that i will be the one who intercedes for you in the day of judgment so you are saying to me if we ask somebody for help that's mean we'll make him god then why you ask muhammad to intercede for you if he is if that will make him god which verse of the quran is that unbelievable so we we have to keep jumping from are, place okay 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 hold on hold on hold on are you saying let me confirm because we are here you, you, you said uh, you are here to call me to get me busted, right? Uh, I already did, actually. Hmm. You did already? Okay. <laughs> it's a good, it. it's a good. The people, they will, they will see it. Okay. okay and then, actually, you know what? Um, uh, this is not, I was exposing your lies. Actually, I got My, my friend, my friend, my friend. So, yeah. you confirm to me that you as a Muslim, you don't believe anywhere in Islam it says that you're a prophet will intercede for you. Um. um that's good. Canal is a good question. Mm -hmm. um, there mm -hmm. are hadith, a hadith did, did say that. Mm -hmm. Yes, uh, but I think well, look. Um, as I said, my my knowledge is limited. It does say that by the will of Allah. Also, if I'm not wrong, something like that. If Allah wills. My friend, you are the one who it, said. You are the one who it, said that if you ask somebody for help, is act of worship. When I was saying that, you just cut me right in the middle. No, you were when talking about Mary. You were talking about so Mary. Asked, so I if somebody, you, you are the one who said that, if somebody asks someone for help, he is he is okay. asking well, someone for help. He is doing an act of oh, worship. If you don't do that, help me. And if I ask my daughter to help me to get me a cup of tea, that means I'm worshiping him. Come on, don't play with words. Help. You know what I mean, help. What help? What when does you, that mean? Okay, tell me what help. Tell me what help. Help is about what? It's about salvation. It's about going to heaven. When you... When you ask this is about somebody. my friend. This is about religion. This is not about help to make zucchini. This is about religion. So help here is about you being saved from torture. In the, this, this, we're talking about judgment day. When I look for if I, if I if I'm here, mm. like, sitting in my sitting room, mm. and I'm asking, Oh Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam, help me and uh, and do this for me and do this for me. That will be a worship, and that's what exactly Allah is talking about. 
the people does to Mary and Jesus and people are still doing my Mary. friend interpretation so please interpretation if you are a truthful show me the interpretation of what you just said interpretation uh, so which interpretation you want me to see my, what you are so talking about what you were talking about that help that 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 uh, you are the one who said if you ask somebody for help he is doing an act of worship but it, and you are the one who said to me what's God Catholics do what's God so what's day. God okay you are the one who said that if the if the if, if the Catholic they ask Mary for help that will make her God correct if they know in the eyes of God that's a worship so that is no problem God. that's a worship so if you ask Muhammad if you ask Muhammad to pray for you that is an act of worship if I ask right now if he's dead if he's dead yes that is worship and I wouldn't do that Okay, people, guys. People uh, in his time, okay, okay, okay. In his guys, time, if he is dead, if he is dead, if he is dead, that will be an act of worship. Is Muhammad is dead now? Muhammad is dead. Yes. Okay. So if you quote the Quran or you just say you ask Muhammad for help and he is dead, that is an act of worship. But I don't. But I don't. No Muslim asks Muhammad Hassan to help. He's dead. When in his lifetime, people ask him to help, and you can ask a good person in a lifetime to help or pray pray to God. Anybody saintly human being, you can say, look, can you pray to God for me? You are a good human being. You can in a lifetime. But when that person died, I cannot ask that person. Do you know there's a hadith of Umar? He, uh, when the rain wasn't coming, he went to the uncle of Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, Abbas. And he said, in the lifetime of the Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, we used to go to him for ask for rain to pray for us. Now he's there, so we're asking you. So, of course, even Umar knew that when the Prophet died, that he did. So, no Muslim... Uh, pray to Muhammad Sallam uh, now. Uh, let me let me ask you. You just said said something very important. <clears throat> I said many things important. You missed, I think, many of them. all of them for sure. Like Muhammad Hijab. Yeah. Listen, never mind. You can, you, you, can you, are who said, you are the one who said. You are the one who said. You are the one who said. If if you ask Muhammad help yep. when he is dead, that is an act of worship. Absolutely. All right. It's shirk. All right. Well, Absolutely. here we go. The Quran in front of us. Okay. Chapter and verse. Okay, hold on, hold on. Let us see. So, uh, don't show me the commentary, please. But well, you love your commentaries. Ah, the commentary. Mm. But do you know that. So you look like the commentary is going to be is going to hurt you. It's going to hurt you. Okay, hold on, hold on. If we go first, we will go step by step. And remember, you are the one who said, if you ask Muhammad when he is dead, huh? If you ask Muhammad when he is dead, help. for help, that mean you are doing an act of worship. It's not me Absolutely. who said that. I said that. Yes, I said okay. that. I'm stand by it. Okay. Can you inter can you give me interpretation of chapter nine, verse number eighty? Why? Why interpret? Oh, okay. My interpretation. Yeah. Okay. My personal interpretation. Yeah. All right. Fair enough. Uh, chapter nine, verse eighty. Okay. It says it is all the same whether or not you ask for their forgiveness. Even if you were to ask forgiveness for them seventy times, Allah shall not forgive them. That is because they disbelieved in Allah and His Messenger. And Allah does not bestow his guidance on such evil doing. So he's, he's telling Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, don't ask for uh, uh, for certain people. It's a context for the context. He, uh, Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam was asking for somebody's forgiveness. So he said, don't ask for their forgiveness. Mm -hmm. uh, even if you ask 70 times, I'm not going to forgive them. So okay. that is my interpretation. You tell me if I'm wrong here. Okay. So if you ask for their forgiveness 70 times, they will not be forgiven. Yeah, okay. you know 70 times. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So how many, those many women, times. so how those women, they will be taken out of hell if they will not be forgiven? Uh, that was not the question. This is the, the question. question we, are, we, have we have the same topic. We have the same topic. We have, we have the same topic. Women, they are going, to, they are in hell already. What is going to make them? Which women are you talking about here? Eh? The, the, the women who have nice vagina and nice, nice uh, etc. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, they will yeah. go to they, you say if you, you you just read for me a verse saying if you ask for forgiveness or not They will not be forgiven. Yeah, okay right. So how those yeah. women they will get out of heaven of out of hell oh, to go to heaven God. You are really dragging me into your box aren't you? Okay. Dra <laughs> dragging me what? You are dragging me into your box you 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 want to confine me in your box and I'm not going to be confined in your box I'll tell you uh, What, what, what do you mean? I don't, I don't understand. I don't understand. What do you mean? You were just taking me in the in the corner. You were just wanted to take me in the corner, and then you just that's how you do it. You know okay, I mean? let me let me ask you. Let me ask you. When yeah. you say to me, when you give me your own personal interpretation, and you don't want me to give you any other interpretation because you are scared, and you are the no, one no, who I'm said not. to me, and you are the one who said to me that 
if you ask for forgiveness or not still they will not be forgiven I read the verse I didn't say that to you I read the verse. okay so are you saying this verse is not consistent with other verses I've never said that okay Can I read the verse before no you are the one because you are trying to swallow your words you are saying no, to I'm me not. now okay okay I'm hold not. on hold on hold on you want me to read the context before can I read the context of this verse as well what con you will read the context based on what uh, you asked me to read the content. What do you mean, on My friend, you know, are, aren't you the one? Yeah. Aren't you the one who is refusing to read the interpretation of the scholars? Uh, CP, what are you doing? My I friend, aren't you the one who refused the interpretation of I'm the scholars? I'm simply asking you, can I read the verse before that so we can understand better? Is there any problem? No problem, that? no problem. But you gave me already the interpretation. You said they will not be forgiven. So I am. Who are they? My question whoever they are who are, are they? they who are they the one who is a sinner yeah, who are they who is the one who will not be before. forgiven okay who is okay hold on 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 people they will go to hell to hell for what reason you're going to go to hell because you lie a lot okay so yeah when a person he go to hell That's he go reason. okay no problem no problem you, you can assault as much you want uh, people who go to uh, hell are they I are they going to hell are they going to hell because all of them they deserve to go to hell or not say that again sorry a person who go to hell is he in hell because he deserved to go to hell or not uh, Allah is so just nobody will be uh, uh, dealt unjustly anybody go to hell they deserve hell of course they do all right so if you try to read for me and you say let us see what kind of people they are it doesn't matter all of them deserve to go to hell so the women I, I, and the women in that hadith is people who deserve to go to hell right yes of course okay so why they are going to be forgiven and they will be taken out of hell so my question to you is is this talking about these women this verse well it's talking about all the people no so it's not talking about these women <laughs> is it? my friend are you saying your God Allah is saying that he will not forgive those who go to hell for a specific people only they are they are in hell already already he's not that, you know already they are in hell for you said to me they are all of them the same you are the one your who point, said to me your point is great mm. only mm. if it's only great if that hadith was authentic so your your whole argument is on the weak hadith and I, that's how I started my argument that hadith is weak mm. I do not believe that mm. that hadith weak mm. hadith I do not I, I don't rely on that okay L uh, let me let me ask you a question am I right or am I wrong no problem no problem no problem you that see? hadith is weak so your argument fails so I guess you bust again my friend let us see what who you get, think, let us see who's getting busted don't hang up people will laugh I'm not hanging up you say it you say it you say it you say it that if you me let me I'm remind you of nowhere. something you said you, you, you said you said you said yes. that if we ask the prophet for help and he is dead yes that is an act of worship absolutely is Muhammad and I dead I understand by it is Muhammad dead? if you show me if you show me prove it to me is Muhammad you, dead no no I want to confirm I want to confirm trust me or not but I learned something I will learn my something. friend I, I'm asking you a very uh, 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 easy question do you believe that your prophet is dead of course he is all right is it true that Muhammad he said that you have read the Quran because the Quran will be presented to me and the Muslims they said to him how we will present the Quran for you when you are dead he said you think prophet are dead but the fact they are not Mm -hmm. Is that true? That's a different existence. Dead in this life. That didn't My friend, he's true. dead, and you're alive, and you are now reciting the Quran for him. But he's dead, can and I you are the one, the... and and you are the one who said, you are the one who said that if you ask the Prophet for help while he is dead, this is an act of worship. How you can do that? What is your source? Can you provide me a source? Okay, let's see. I I don't expect you to trust me, and I don't think I trust you as well. I wanted to read the source. Well, I don't, I don't trust any Muslim anyway. <clears throat> well, I trust many Christians. There are many good friends. Uh, they are good people. But uh, I'm afraid my experience with you is I don't know. What do you mean? Uh, what do you mean you trust uh, Christians? What does that mean? Uh, as a as a human being uh, and their word, I do. You do what? I I do so I trust their word. Many of the Christians I trust their words. I do as a as a human being. I trust. No, are you uh, are you a Muslim allowed to trust the Christians? Oh. <laughs> Okay, uh, do we allow to trust Christian? Yeah. Okay, you want me to take it to the box? I will go with you uh, into that box where you're taking me right now. Uh, yes. Yes. Are you yes. sure? Are you sure? I'm, I'm, I'm definitely sure. Prove can, me wrong. can you give me a proof? Well, I can't. I, I, on top of my mind, top of my head, I can't. I don't know. Okay, don't as long let like us you. let us change the topic a little bit, get you busted. In chapter That's five, it. in chapter Fair five, enough. verse number uh, uh, 51, it says, 
take not Christians and Jews as a friends and protectors right Fight and if you do so you are one of them mm -hmm. believers do not take the Jews and the Christians as a friend for your allies it's or friends allies. and if you do so you are one of them how do you say friend in Arabic oh yeah is the same and how is a protector in Arabic it's the same so why are you taking as a friend why can't you take it as a protector why are you taking the way you want because to? simply if somebody he want to protect you obviously is your friend too right uh, not necessarily ah, okay here we go this is a translation in front of me this is your Muslim translation it says oh who you believe take not the Jews and the Christians for your friends and protectors they are but the friends and protectors to each other and he amongst you that he turns to them for friendship is is of them he is one of them so now you are saying to me i trust the christians and i have them as a friend so if you have them as a friend and you trust them that's mean you are one of us so you left islam oh hallelujah uh, can i say something now <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah can i say something go ahead okay you know what um let's say for the sake of argument uh no no for the sake of argument why is it for the sake of argument Let's say the friend word is not there. It says, if you take them as your protectors, do you have a problem with that? You think you, your, your case become weak. If he says, if you take them as your protector, then your case is not strong. Is that right? I'm listening, my friend. Don't tell me it's right yeah. or not. It says, so, if you take them okay. as a friend or protectors, you are okay. one of them. No, no, no. Your translation is using both words, friends and protectors. I wonder why. Because they hear the word used with Nasara or Liya, why when they say olia they're using both words friend and protector i wonder and every time it's a olia your translation say friend or protector why why if it doesn't say uh, friend but it says protector where where and where it says protector you, where, where it says protector where it says protectors where it says protectors olia 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 do you speak arabic you do you speak arabic you do you speak arabic no i didn't so okay how you know help. so you how you can... me okay here we go i'm showing you muslim I'm translation to to i'm showing point. you i'm showing you the muslim translation you see it's like you look like you like you like a certain translation and you like it and you're stuck with it this is Yusuf <laughs> ali is he as a muslim imam or he is a uh, he's a hindu i i i'm uh, reading the uh, maududi's translation much, no problem much, no problem my friend my friend maududi 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 okay let us let us fix this argument based yeah. on this verse regardless of the translation which is scholar agree with you that you can take a christian or a jew as a friend i i know what you're saying and there are many muslims have this problem my friend don't tell me we have a problem you have all of islam is a problem don't don't play no, games give me one scholar in the world agree with you saying that yes we can take a christians and jews as a friends as interpretation for this verse uh look the verse itself don't uh, tell I me look be... i don't want to look you see i want to i want to finish this okay. Because okay, let's, you're let's playing games, you're playing games. Which is scholar yeah, you agree? Enough. Which is scholar? My, right. not, my friend, my friend, you see, you are jumping from topic to topic like a monkey, and you are Am trying I? to say, you are trying to say that you are getting me busted. But the fact each time we, we speak about something, you claim, don't go to interpretation, don't read interpretation, don't go there, don't go here. So you want to debate me without going anywhere. So why not? Why do you want to do that? Give me one Muslim scholar agree with you about this chapter and about the verse we are talking about. That you are telling the truth, that you have a Christians you can trust, and they can be your friends. Show me. Who first is the scholar all, agree with you? First of all, I'm not jumping from here to there. Actually, I'm going wherever you're taking me. Really? You are opening verses. Okay, now show I'm me. No problem. Show me, my anywhere. friend. Convince, convince the crowd, not me. What Secondly, is the scholar name? What is the scholar name? I agree with you. Ask. Are you saying to me by by running away from giving me one scholar agree with you that no scholar in the world agree with you? Why you keep using the term running away? Don't because go, you need don't, to show me. Show me one scholar agree with you. Mean? There's no way. There's 1.1 billion Muslims, and yet you cannot find me. One Muslim agree with you. You know, you you are very, very good. And I give you that. You, you play psychology with people in you know, psychology. That's what you do. You keep <laughs> using the word every three, four minutes. Don't run away. Don't hang up and all that like I'm doing that. And people uh, who, who listen to you, they think, oh, yeah. So I think uh, you believe that the, the if you lie lo loud enough and often enough, people will follow you. And this is this is this is obvious. That's what you're doing. I'm not running away anyway. But what I'm admitting is this: uh, first of all, that you are much more informed in in knowledge than me. But when you put something across to me, don't expect me expect that I'm going to come back straight away with the answer. I'm I'm admitting that. But if you saying that to me to prove it to me, if any Muslim scholar agree with me. I can look into that. I my friend, my friend, my friend. I can come back as to long tomorrow. as long you I are calling me. Okay, how how you explain to me a verse without going and checking? And uh, so are you, you are saying to me, I am a person who have no knowledge. I'm calling you to get you busted 
but I do not know much. I, I'm, I'm, I'm no one. I know nothing. And there is yeah. no scholar agree with me. I have my own opinion. I am the only Muslim who believe in this, and the rest forget about them. And that. I don't have I'm time. No, you said that. Otherwise, okay. What? what, what no why you keep saying that. to me? Why I each time that. I mention something to you? Why you say to me? Don't show me the interpretation. The, uh, okay, that's the question I was going to ask you, mm. uh, CP. Do you believe interpretations are infallible? My friend, I believe Islam, all of it is false. <laughs> that's not the question. Your prophet himself is false. So, so this is not, not. No, this is he the is question. The you, you, when you, the you, when, when you say to me, you, when you say to me, my friend, when you say to me, do you believe in this? I believe Islam, all of it is false. Uh, CP, I, I think you are selective when you take uh, interpretation. You see, you not? my friend, my, you, you, my, uh, you are trying to avoid the challenge. Because uh -huh. why you are giving me your own false interpretation, yet you claim that you are the one who knows. But in, when when you are in the corner, suddenly I am. In, you introduce yourself as a speaker corner. You introduce yeah. yourself that you want to get me busted. You introduce yourself that you know. And the second we start squeak, squeezing you, and the mayonnaise is coming out, suddenly you came. It, you, <laughs> you take it all off, and you say, "I have to admit that you have a lot knowledge more than me. I do not know much." I have to go and do some study. I have to do some search. And no, Christian Prince, that. you are scared of me. And it's Christian Prince, why you don't answer me? Christian Prince, why you don't debate me? And when we debate you, you run. You saying I do not know. I'm not. I'm not. So let's, tell me then why you say to me I do not know. A second ago, a second ago, you said to me I do not know anything. I am. I know nothing. I know CP. nothing. You do CP. not know anything. CP, I know enough that Olia does not only mean friend. Okay. So you must understand. No, my friend, you do not know because if you know, then you have to prove it. Worse, if if if, if you know, if you know, you have to prove it. It's not enough to say I know no, no, what no. is enough. You see, here mm. we don't make our opinion. I don't give you my opinion about the verses. I show you what it says. If you if you can prove me wrong, prove me wrong. So when you say you to me, when you say to me, the verse does not mean that you don't even speak Arabic. You, you do not even know how to, to to pronounce the name of your prophet correctly. Let me hear you say Muhammad. Muhammad see you do not know even how to say your prophet name correctly so even the name you get it wrong and yet it is Muhammad not Muhammad is it a sin my friend it's a sin to lie and to say to me that no, you no, know no. what you are talking about and when I asked you what is the meaning you cannot prove to me what you are claiming to be the meaning I did. I proved my friend you. my friend you proved to I me read, I read Quran thank you thank you I for said, thank you for calling thank you for calling I I really hang I, on I, you, no 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 you, you see I there's no point of speaking with someone saying to me I do not know I do not okay. know you just admitted that you do not know you admitted also, that you do not so what you okay so why you why you time? don't want okay hold on let us accept the challenge again let us go to zero name for me one scholar agree with you Okay, the guys, the guy who became Muslim. My friend, Muslim, my friend, name for me, name for me. One is scholar Christ. agree with you. If you are not lying, if you are not fabricating, if you are not practicing taqiyya, name one scholar agree with you that you can take a Christians and Jews as a friends. So can you? Okay, can no, you? No, no. Listen, listen. Can I say something? Can you? Can you give me twenty seconds? Can I have twenty seconds to speak? <laughs> I'm talking no, to you already you. for an hour. Is it? Okay, yeah. that is good. Not bad. I mean, yeah. lasting with you for an hour, not bad. Right, right. Any, uh. Anyway, listen, um, 20, 20 seconds, I'll say. First of all, let's say you say, can you prove it to me, any scholar that agrees with me? And I told you the reason. I'm, I'm very limited in, uh, in in all the information. But I put you back question to you. Are you saying every scholar agree with what you're saying? Yes, did you hear this? Are you saying every scholar agree with what you're saying? Yeah, <laughs> it meaning you cannot you cannot be friend. Look how with, look how look how funny you are. Look how funny. Oh. Are you saying to me? Look, look how you are proving to me. You are proving to me that you Muslims, you follow our religion, very confusing to the point oh. even scholars don't agree with each other because you are saying to me, you do every scholar agree with you, which means there's scholars agree with me and there's scholars don't agree with me. And this is the challenge for you. Name for me one scholar. Yes, don't agree with me. Okay, scholar. a challenge, a challenge, a challenge. You said to me, are you seeing Christian Prince that every scholar agree with you, brother? Yes, I say every scholar agree with me. Show me one, don't agree with me. Okay, so you're saying every scholar agree with you that uh, yes, cannot be friends with yes, Christian. yes, every scholar. Yes, every scholar. Oh, it's going to be so easy to bust you. Okay, really. I'm, I'm listening. Well, no, I'm not providing you now. I'm going to call you tomorrow. <laughs> No, because if you said that, Abdul, is lie, Abdul, no, lie. I will get you busted right now. I will go right now to at tafsir.com and I will show all the tafsir in the website, all of them, the real scholars, not Zakir Naik, potato, tomato. Those are the scholars, 
and we will see we will see we will see what they are saying if they are saying if they are saying what i am saying abdul 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 you've been served and you've been cooked you've been you've been not only you've been slaughtered you've been barbecued you call me to get me busted abdul are you serious are you serious okay let's go listen to me listen to me chapter 5 chapter 5 chapter 5 verse number 51 name for me any scholar you wish any scholar you wish right now El Maududi. Who is El Maududi? Oh my God! You don't even. My friend, are you to the one who said to me translation of El Maududi? He he has a tafsir tafhimul Quran. Okay, you want tafhimul Quran, guys? He said El Maududi, correct? Yeah. Okay, be my witness. Okay, I will go to El Maududi. And remember your word. You say every. My brother, my brother. Let us see El Maududi. El Maududi, Maududi is your scholar, right? I can assure you right now. Okay, okay. Hold on, hold on. Okay, okay. You're wrong. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. This is this is my challenge to you. I'm going to come back to you to prove that you are wrong. My friend, don't come to me. We are here. Don't, don't, don't run. Don't run. Let us finish. Everybody will laugh. <laughs> that every five minutes. All right, hold on. It's a psychology you play with people. Hmm. I'm listening. I'm trying to find you the tafsir you like. Yeah, yeah, yeah fine. Uh, tafsir al Quran. That you show me that you can't be friend with uh, Christians. Period. Hmm. That's it. You can never be friend with Christian. And you know what? Oh, I just remember something to bust you. Oh, I just remember something to bus you, but I need your help so I can bus you. Yeah, okay, you are busting me all the yeah. way, you know. I mean, uh, no, no. Uh, I mean, now you want to bust me already? You did already. Hey, many hey, times. Hey, I just remember something. You see, Allah has put something in my mind. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Yes, yes. All right. <laughs> Let us see. Before you go to the seat, I, actually, I can. Well, that's right. I'll give you a chance. You, you just show me. The female Quran says that you can never be friends with any Christian. Hmm. We are waiting. Clock is ticking. Well, I'm looking for for you. Do you have a link for a Maududi? Yeah, I'm looking for this. I'm looking for this Maududi. Duty. <laughs> Can you provide me with the link? Yeah, I'm trying to help I'm you. Not. I'm trying to help you to find okay. it. Where is where is this guy, Maududi? Listen, okay. Before you find that, can I uh, give you a proof that you can be friend with the uh, Christians and my and friend, Jews? my friend? No, from don't, Quran, don't from the Quran. The don't verse from the Quran. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You go, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, right, go ahead. Right, Subhanallah. Chapter five, verse five. Uh -huh. This day, all good things have been made lawful to you. Mm. The food of the people of the <clears> book <throat> is permitted to you, mm. and your food is permitted to them. Mm. And permitted to you are mm. chaste women. Be they either from among the believers mm. or from among those who have received the book before you, meaning Christians and Jews. Mm. And this is the interpretation of uh, the sea of Maududi of this verse. Mm. And He's talking about the okay. Jews and the As long as this is tafsir of Maududi, why do they give me a Maududi link so we can see the verse? I can't. I can't put on the internet. Why you cannot? Down. Why? 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 I'm not, I'm not you see, savvy. why they are not counting this guy Al Maududi in the list of the scholars here? You see, I'm looking at all the tafsirs. Where is Al Maududi? Do you sure, see? Do you see CP, him? CP, CP, my friend, my friend. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Same time, same time. I'm reading to same you, time, CP, same time. Let me see. Let me ask you. Let me ask you. Let me ask you. I was making a point. My friend, no, you know, no. You, you make you, know, you, you make you make you make, a, you you make as many points as you, you want. Everybody you make a that. point as you want, as you wish. Your prophet he ordered to kill all the Christians and all the Jews if they don't convert to Islam. And he said, Don't take them because they are my enemies. And when I say to you, show me one scholar agree with you, you said to me, Al Maududi. Now show me Al Maududi. Can you show me Al Maududi? Can you show me Al Maududi? What is what is why why he is not why he is not listed here? All the scholars agree with me, and I challenge you to prove me wrong. I challenge you. I am proving it you wrong. Right Where now, you prove me wrong? Not. The verse you you say to me, they, it says they can cook for you. You can, can marry from them. So what? Can, Muhammad, can he want to spread Islam. He in the beginning he forbid them. He forbid them from. Listen, listen, Abdul. Is the mushrikun a najis or not? Is the mushrikun a najis or not? Is the mushrikun a najis or not? Why are you calling me? Abdul? Because you are Abdul, isn't it? Muhammad, he says everyone is a slave of Allah. Okay, so okay. that's Abdullah, not Abdul. This is Abdul. Now listen. No, no, Abdullah. Abdullah is a slave of Shaitan because his the father of Muhammad is Abdullah. Are you a slave? You are a slave of Shaitan. No, are you? I'm asking. Is, you is the father of Muhammad, his name is Abdullah, yes or no? Yes, yes. Okay, so why he is going to Don't go to hell? Don't change the topic. You, are, you, you are the one who mentioned, you are the one who no, switched to no, Abdul. No, I, I'm asking you a question. Now, Abdul, 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 listen, listen. All are the interpretation, no, no. all the interpretation yes in no. front of me get you busted. This is Ibn Kathir in the front of my eyes. This is Ibn Kathir. This is Ibn Kathir. 
get a new busted. Well, choose anyone else. Al Maududi is not here. What I would do? Where is Al Maududi? Can I have 30 seconds? My friend, where is Al Maududi to show it to you? Do you sit in the list with Why me? Here we go. I am showing you. I'm showing you the list of the scholars. He is not even counted as a scholar. Fair enough. Okay, let's let's forget about Mudu. Okay, can you choose for me a scholar? Okay. Can I have? Can you choose? No, no, no. Can you choose for me oh, a scholar? People, people, what do you think? Why is not giving me chance? Bec no, I'm, not, I'm giving you a chance. You want to jump over the topic? Can you show me a scholar? I agree with you. I'm only look how many scholars we have in the list. Look, look how many. Look, look. I we have, we have like, we have like three hundred. We have a, a, a like three hundred scholars, and not even one of them agree with you. In in the name of God, just give me thirty seconds. The name the name of the black stone. <laughs> in the name of God, just give me thirty seconds. If you are, if you are for the sake of the truth, my friend, let me ask you. Tafsir al Maududi written which year? People, I'm asking in thirty seconds. Why is not giving me thirty Taf seconds? Tafsir al Maududi written which year? I say forget about Maududi if you can't find it. I am asking you to give me thirty seconds. Can I? Thirty seconds. Yes. All the, 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 the time you spoke until now, you don't, don't have 30 seconds yet? You never gave me. Oh, I'm okay. Really? Permission. Really? People are witnessing. I'm asking your permission. Okay, go ahead. Thank you very much. So this verse, chapter 5, verse 5, is actually telling you to marry uh, the uh, people of the book. Now, if your question is, if Hadith is telling you, you can never be friends with Christians and Jews, you're basically telling me, Allah telling you to marry with your enemies, live life with your enemies. That's what you're saying? Is this your logic and reason, CP? Are you telling me Hadith say don't be friends with Christian and Jews? Tafsir say that, but the Quran telling you to marry, have a wife, Christian and Jew. And you telling me you, you it's your enemy. You can never be friends with her, but you can marry. Hello. <coughs> and the guy is gone. Are you there? Hello. 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 I don't want to hang up on him. He will say you hang up. Are you there, Abdul? Are you there? I don't know what happened. All right, call me back, Abdul. I'm trying to find Al Maududi so we can we can read for him Al Maududi so we can love. Okay, let me see. I'm trying to find Al Maududi just to show you how they lie. I never saw a Muslim telling the truth ever. And you notice how they jump from place to place. And when, when you when you squeeze them hard, this is we I did not even squeeze him hard actually. I was just uh, going softly on him. The second you start squeezing is the same second he said to me i don't claim that i know more than you but you are the one who called me to get me busted so you want to get me busted but you do not know more than me and when we challenge him to show us one scholar agree with him he could not he, he, he named for me a book which i cannot find anywhere if anyone please guys can find me the book let us love uh, okay let's see here maybe this website court to be uh okay hold on Okay, we found, we, I found Al Maududi. Let us get this guy, uh, uh, bust, uh, Abdul Busted. I found this verse, interpretation for chapter 3, verse number, this is the verse. لا يتخد المؤمنون الكافرين. Let us see, maybe somebody send me a link for Al Maududi. What is that? Okay, well, we can try. Let us see. All right. Let us see. This is Al Maududi. All right. Let us go. Chapter 5. I thank you for the one who sent it. We need to go, but what is mean this man? This we have to go all the way down. Oh boy, call me back, Abdul. Call, call me. Look like we got you, Al Maududi. You see, I do not know what is even written in there, but I am sure what I'm talking about. Call me back, Abdul. Uh, oh, believer, take not the Jews or the Christians as your friends. This is Al Maududi, liar. This is your shish kebab, Al Maududi. Do you see it? Do you see, guys, how they lie? This is Al Maududi. Oh, who you believe take not the Jews nor the Christians as a friends they are one friends only if any of you takes them as a friends surely he shall be counted among them which means he's out of Islam <laughs> brother read for me al-maududi brother brother a Christian prince uh, today I call you I'm a, I'm a speaker corner and I'm going to get you busted brother and uh, you are lying brother uh, brother we Muslims, we are going to get you busted, brother. Uh, my friend, the speaker corner, you did not mention your name to us. Don't forget to post in the text down there your name, so we will make you famous more. Please give me your name. Leave it in the in the after we finish the broadcast. If you will not dare to call me again, and tell me why you lie to us. Says Al Maududi did not say that, and you are the one who chose Al Maududi. And as you see, this is a, this is a website I do not know. I never used before. This is here. We go. We go on the top. Okay. It says. 
Sayyid Abu Al Abu Al Mawdudi. Do you see it? He is the one who chose, not me. It was his choice. When I say Muslims, they lie. We are sharing the truth. Those people, they lie. They cannot be honest. They love to lie. This is why I say, when you debate a Muslim, you are not debating a Muslim. You are playing with the devil. He will do his best to lie as much as he can. But anyway, it always turns for our benefit. They try to defend, but they get their profit busted. They try to fight, but they do the opposite. Hello? Yeah, hello, CP. Yes, my um, friend. I just want to know that the, the, the guy that you were talking to is a, he's on speaker corner. He has a lot of video on, the, on YouTube, but um, hmm. I think I can recognize his face on the on the speaker corner. Just let you know that um, his video is there a lot, that he also debates on speaker corner. As you already said, that the video is there. Yeah, well, you know, th that's even better because that will show everybody that those who they are in speaking corner, they are a bunch of potatoes. They do not know what they are talking about. They go to speaker corner, but yet they have no education. They don't maybe even have high school about Islam or maybe even normal high school. But yet they want to go in the speaker corner and they want to educate you about their religion. And the second they meet with somebody, he asks them questions which they cannot answer. Very simple questions. They run away like potatoes and they don't never come back. I mean, why why he don't call back? <laughs> why he don't call back? Al Maududi, here we go. We found Al Maududi for him. What do you want more? You ask for a Maududi. You made us search all this time for the Maududi uh, uh, boy. Okay, we found a Maududi. You see, they choose. They choose something they thought is going to make a difference for them. Okay, I'm going to ask him for something. Uh, it's not the, in the website he always usually he use to get us busted. So what we will do? We will say to him Al Maududi, and then we go and we spend our time looking for this guy Al Maududi. What we will do now? Any Muslim? Look what Al Maududi he said. Let me show the screen. My, my friend, look, your, your connection is bad, so I have to hang up on you. This is Al-Mawdudi. It's a moral condition, my friend. You cannot take them as a friend. Moral condition of the Jews and the Christians, the believers have been warned not to take their friends and confidence. Do you see it? This is Al-Mawdudi. Dudi, Dudi, Dudi. This is Dudi Al-Fayd. Dudi. Oh, who you believe, take not the Jews and the Christians as a friends. Why? Because the enemy of Allah, because they are the enemy of Allah, liars, liars. We are here to get you busted. Did you have a good time, guys? Did we have a good time? I hope this guy, if he is brave enough to download the video in his conversation with me and to post it in YouTube without any editing, if he is brave, you know what I mean? Because if this is a victory, I advise every Muslim to, the, to, to download the video, which is a victory for Islam. Here we go, your brother, he was busting me all the way. Copy it all over. Don't cut anything, brother, because it was a pure victory for Allah. If you don't do that, it's mean he's a coward. Call him, please. Yeah, where is his name? Because he is not in my list. Where is his name? Mm, I'm trying to find which one he called me from. Okay, this one, I think. Let us see. See, he's gone. His history is gone. Yeah, I'm calling him, calling him, but he is not answering. He's gone. He's, he's offline. He's gone. Hello? Hello, CP. This is Simon. Hey, my brother. How are you? Hello. So, um, I'd like to ask for your interpretation of what you're showing on the screen. Um, you're showing basically a doctrine of warfare against a civilization that's outside their civilization. How should we interpret this? That's it. There is no, there is no friendship between us and them. And if you are a Christian and you take them as a friend, it's mean you are a fool because you know they will not accept you as a friend, and you are just fooling yourself, saying, "Okay, they are friends." Very simple. I mean, it says it clearly. You can go and read all the interpretation in, in Muslim books have. Yeah, all of them yeah. they say that you cannot take them as a friends for they are your enemies so any christian he say i have a muslim friend he's fooling himself he's being stupid sorry to say that but we have them as our neighbors in our countries i mean how should we interpret it this is very very serious well this it's is very serious. that's it there's no other interpretation that's it treason you see the muslims the muslims if they are following islam they will not take you as a friend you might find a muslim he don't follow islam 
he take sure. as a friend but how we will know now which one because the Muslim remember in chapter 3 verse number if we go this is al Maududi, right this is al Maududi. I will use the Maududi which he because he like if we go That's to al Maududi and we go to chapter 3 verse number 28 okay you will find that the Quran says that you cannot take us as a friend but you can lie to us claim to be a friend if we go here let us see to verse number 28 <clears throat> all right let not the believers make the disbelievers their friends and take them into the, their confidence preference of the believers whoever will do this shall have no re uh, relation left to Allah the liar was saying to me that he is a Muslim he have a Christian friend he trusts them etc when I question him he said no we can are you saying to me we can marry of Christian women but we cannot be friend to you <laughs> yeah yeah I heard about that and that's that's also very interesting you had an interesting broadcast because I found out about you about you two years ago uh, CP I have basically two two of your books and what you have taught me is that Muslims are willing to deceive and this is something that my Western mind won't accept. Well, uh, I mean, I, I cannot, I cannot say if somebody is. You see, even in law, they say uh, uh, being ignorant does not protect you. You cannot say I was ignorant. You know, you cannot. Yeah, so yeah, but if, it, it if they want to be very, ignorant, very different from our worldview. You know, if someone tells you a price, then that's the price. You know, it's not like they're adding ten times the price to try to trick you. So this is a little bit different from what we are taught. Yeah. Well. And. This, yeah, this, so why, this why I'm here my friend. I'm here to, to teach what is right what is true and I always show the reference and I get them busted And look what happened now. This guy was arguing with me and he challenged me Are you saying that all the scholars agree with you? I said yes I said okay. Well prove me wrong. Give me the scholar agree with you not with me. He gave me this look He is the one who named for me that proved that he is an idiot. He's a donkey. He never even read the book He's talking about yeah, I, I do agree with that. I mean, all doctrine, all verse, all hadith, I do agree with that. Um, but also we know in psychology that there's a discrepancy between behavior and attitudes. It's called cognitive dissonance. Basically, you believe one thing, but in your behavior, you will do something else. What do you think about that? I cannot comment much about something that's called behavior. I can't comment. No, cognitive I can, dissonance. I, I can say that a human being, a human being, sometimes he chose to be stupid because he didn't want to face something uh, he hit he had to face as simple as that you know? Okay, let, let me let me just formulate my question differently. I, I heard your discussion with a Muslim lady a couple of years ago It's on YouTube fantastic conversation. It's one hour She was coming off as Islam is very peaceful is good for women and then just squeezed her You know for a while and she was like yes I cannot take Muslims as my friends and she was just taking basically telling her telling you everything that she thought and my question is do you think that most Muslims believe what the Quran says you cannot be a Muslim if you don't believe in the Quran, what the Quran says. You cannot be a Christian if you don't believe what Jesus said, correct? Yeah, yeah, so, yeah. No, no. Yeah. No, I so, think it's wrong, so, so to be to be called Muslim, what is Muslim? Muslim is somebody to believe in Islam, and this is Islam. But we also have Coca-Cola light Muslims, you know, they don't read the stuff, they don't know about stuff, they're just born into it, you know. Yeah, but you see, this is what I'm saying. There's a Muslim, yeah. there's a Muslim by name, there's a Muslim. Now, Muslim by name, how I know that this guy he is not trying to act as if he is a Muslim by name. Sure. You know, because the Quran allowed them that chapter, the, the same verse we are reading. It says you can, you can guard yourself from them. You cannot take them as a friend, but you can speak to them in a friendly way. But in your heart, you should not believe that they are your friends. So yeah, he, I've seen he it. can I've seen say it. to me, I don't believe in this. That's just to protect himself. He can, he is allowed to deny his belief. You know? So if we, if we take what, what, what the verse says seriously, that means that we have, uh, maybe you can correct me if I'm wrong. We have a population that have a hidden agenda um, to destroy our civilization. Yeah, actually, the human being destroy always his civilization by himself, and and most them they are destroying themselves too. You see, sure, Islam, Islam is is uh, is not only destroying others; is trying destroying Muslims too. Because when a Muslim he believe in destruction, the first thing destruction will bring is destruction, and that will be for mankind. And Muslim is the first to suffer. Go right now 50 50 people they get killed today in, in suicide bombing in afghanistan under 40 in somalia kidnapping in libya i mean it's all over all over or, or, you know because of islam how filthy yesterday they arrested a group of people in australia they were trying to shoot as many as they can of australian waiting for the crowd to be shot and to be killed that is islam so now we have the whole world in chaos because of filthy cult teaching hate sure I have no problem to take a Muslim as a friend. Why? Why not? I mean, why not? Yeah, I mean, yeah. He's a human being like me. He can be a good person. 
he can be a nice person he can be even better for me from somebody he, he claimed to be a Christian but sure. here because because of this teaching I will be stupid to believe that he is my my friend because now what I what if he is a person is aware of this and he believe as long as he called himself Muslim that's when he believe in this yeah yeah of course um so yeah, I, I do agree that what you're saying is the Muslim belief. That's their attitude based on their books. And we have statistics on Muslim actually agreeing with this. I do agree with this. But this also means that if we're going to take what they believe serious, that means that our way of viewing them is different now. You know, you have to take um, safety per, uh, precautions because this is about your kid's future, right? So how do you as a Christian, I'm a Christian as well, by the way. And for those asking in the chat, yes, this is Takiya Watch. I'm asking how do you as a Christian reconcile what what Christ taught to love your enemies while people are committed to a dangerous ideology how do you my get friend, these two together my friend the bible teaches us to be smart like the snake is smart supposedly sure. here and to be peaceful like a pigeon so yeah. you have you have to bring two together peaceful and stupid that is not being christian so as long as i know peaceful i love peace promote peace teach peace teach love we don't teach hate yeah same time I have to be smart as long as I know that those principal believe that they have a duty to fight me and to kill me and they have a target to take over me so then if I allow them to do that that's, that's, that's me. Right. I'm being stupid so that's I right. have to prevent them from doing their target and I do that by spreading knowledge ignorance is the number one problem is in the world yeah because yeah. now anyone he saw what happened today he will agree that he cannot take a Muslim as a friend, not because he is against that, but because Islam is against that. That's right. So if I take him as a friend, I have no problem to take him as a friend, but he, his religion, uh, don't allow him. So if I believe he's my friend, that means I'm being stupid. Yeah, I, I don't understand what you mean. Yeah. So, so we have, we to, have, we it, have to find, we have to fight stupidity. You see, before, yeah. before fighting Islam, we have to fight stupidity. The Bible says my people, they've been destroyed because of their ignorance. So yeah, we'll see a four. Yeah. The problem in the world today is ignorance. Ignorance is every uh, even like, even if you take it in a scientific way, uh, why people are dying from cancer because we are ignorant about cancer, how we can fight it. You know, I'm sure time will come and they will find a very easy solution to cancer. Not long time ago, millions they used to die by the flu. Every year, millions and millions of people sure. die. It's sure. a, it's just a stupid flu, but it was a small, tiny bacteria that kill millions. So what was killing them is our ignorance so in order to have a better life safe life secure life you need to fight your ignorance and this is one okay, of the so, ignorance we are suffering so, from so let's be practical so if you know if, if people here knows what what you have shown on the screen so how do you implement this in reality so you know that people have a hidden agenda if they believe this stuff so how do you deal with it i mean is it like you don't taking people from a certain nation that has muslim majority nation how do you implement this in reality well, I cannot tell everyone what to do. You see, everybody sure. has his own brain and everybody has his own situation. It's not like a fixed solution for everybody. But yeah. I will have question that those people don't, they believe in me as an enemy. So I always I have to look at it in a certain way that they are not, they don't mean what they say. He's trying to call me, if you don't mind, I will take him back, okay? Okay, do that. Let us see, he's online now. I don't think he's trying to call me, but he is. he's online. Thank you, my friend. Okay. <clears throat> <laughs> Hello. Hey, my friend, the speaker corner. I really do apologize. My connection was completely gone bad. So all I was right. trying all the time. Okay, yes, my friend. I was I was listening to you, okay. listening to you. Okay. Yes, go ahead. We have a Maududi in the front of us, and a Maududi yes. agree with me, not with you. What we will do now? Uh, which verse and what did he say? You can go to any verse you want. This is a chapter three, verse twenty-eight, and we will show you verse 20, 20, uh, five fifty-one, the one we were talking about. Okay. In both so, scenario, the both scenario, yeah, El Maududi agree with us. So what what you want to say? Uh, I'm going to read it. Is that all right with you? Sure. <clears throat> okay. It says the believers may not take the unbelievers for their allies. My friend, are you, fact, reading, are you reading El Maududi? I'm reading El Maududi. Yeah, I'm reading the guys. Um, guys, translation. do you see what he is saying? It doesn't say that. All you believe, my friend. All who you believe. Do not take the Jews nor the Christians as your friends. They are one another friends only. And this is El Maududi. This is El Maududi. Let me show Chapter you. Three, my friend, let, let me show you. Let me show you the top of the link. See, I can't see the screen. Yes, okay, yes. I will give you I will give you the link. No problem. Let me give you the link in your Skype, please. Okay. 
You know, I'm not, one second, just hold on a second. I have to call my daughter. I'm not very good in these things. It's the second time ever I'm calling Skype. Hmm. Just give me a second. Oh, yes, you send me the link. All okay. right. This is El Maududi. Check it out. Uh, all right. I press the link. Okay. English tafsir.com. This is a Muslim website. Nothing, nothing comes up. You just, I just press the link. No, it should come. Why not? In your, in, the, in the screen, I can just see debate TV and the blue screen. No, no, no. Click at the chat. Click at the chat. There's a link there. Did you see the link? Uh, chat, you mean on the left corner? Yeah, yeah in the left corner, there's like a conversation. Yeah, okay. All right. Click at yes. the link. Click at the link, please. Uh, I did. All right. Surah Al Maida. Okay. Okay. Al Maududi. Yes, Al Maududi. Does it say, does it say there Al Maududi? One second. It's not coming yet. Okay. Uh, Sayyid Abu Al Maududi. Yes. Okay. Go, go, go down to 551. Go to 51. Down all the way. Yeah. One second. 551. Hmm. Oh, I've gone a little too far. Sorry, I'm not very good in these things. No problem. I use my phone. Okay, 551. Yeah, I got it there. Okay. Believers do not take the Jews and the Christians as your friends. They are one another's friends only if one, any one of you takes them friends. I'm reading what uh, is saying on the laptop. Mm -hmm. Now, I got the phone here with me in my hand. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. In that, the female Quran, I have the female Quran. You mm -hmm. believe it or not, it's up to you. Mm -hmm. um, in that, uh, the translation it says... Uh, the believers may not take the unbelievers for their allies in preference on this one. Mm. Okay, here it says, but it's okay, that doesn't make any difference. No problem. Mm. We take what they with the translation say, hey, friends. Yes, mm. so the word here uses olia. Mm. Is that right? Mm. Okay, Madudi say here is mean friends, mm. but the word uses olia, which can also mean protector. Mm. Yeah, and, and so when when you ask me to quote you, uh, uh any scholar, mm. I did quote you, Madudi. Yes. Mm. And Maududi is talking about hair, friends here. Okay. But my question is this here. Mm. When Allah is telling us, you can marry a Christian Jew and, and a Christian a Jewish, mm. uh, a Christian or Jew woman, mm. how does it uh, make sense that they cannot be your friend, but you can marry them? Because Muhammad, it make, you are right with this question. It doesn't make sense. And this is a very good question of you. Islam doesn't make sense anyway. Muhammad wanted mm. to spend this, spread Islam by having more babies. And now they capture a lot of women and they want to have their babies. So this is for the benefit because as you know in Islam if you have women and you have sex with her the baby will be a Muslim will not be a Christian so it's a win-win for Muhammad in the beginning of Islam in the beginning of Muhammad he said that you cannot marry a, 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 a non-believer woman so uh, Muhammad he changed his mind because he found himself he is losing uh, a lot of by by by, uh, by doing that he lost a lot of members uh, to to became part of uh, 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 part of Islam or babies and he need mm -hmm. that uh, so Muhammad he changed his mind always and this is one of the funny things about Muhammad proving that he is uh, not a prophet because how come in one verse in the Quran uh, it says you cannot marry non-Muslim and he forbid them from marrying non-Muslims and then he make another verse in the Quran saying well you can marry a Muslim so that's the question would be good to ask for you mm -hmm. how you can okay. be how you can be how you how you can allow how you forbid them uh, uh, from marrying non-Muslims in a verse, and then you allow them to marry non-Muslims in different verse. Do you have or, an answer? Or if it's if you take Quran as consistent, yeah, Quran is telling you you can marry Christian uh, women and Jewish women, mm -hmm. and this verse they are saying Aliyah, which is supposed to be protector and our friends. No, my friend, because the Quran is not consistent. Because I just say to you, different verse in the Quran saying you cannot marry. You cannot marry. Yes. Okay, that is a contradiction. You know that, but show okay, me that. Thank verse, you. Then. Okay, guys, did you hear uh, this gentleman say this is a contradiction? All yes, right. I'm saying it. All right, thank you. Because I'm a, I'm a seeker of truth, yeah, my, my and friend, I believe my, it. My yeah, friend, I'm not okay, going to hide okay. behind it. I, I believe Quran has not a single contradiction. No problem. Okay? Wala, That's another topic, no and I'm problem, putting myself no in the problem, box, so you, no can, you, can, you can bring it to me. Okay. You no, are, Quran say you can my marry. My friend, hold on, women. hold your horses. Just you say yeah. this is a really a contradiction. If we can prove it, wala yes. tankihu, wala tankihu al mushrikat hatta yu'minna. Chapter two, verse number two to one. The mic is yours. Chapter two, verse two to one. Yeah. No problem. Okay, here it says, marry not the women who associate others with Allah in his divinity until they believe. For a believing slave girl is better okay. than a woman who associates others with Allah in his divinity, okay. even though she might please you. Likewise, do not give your women 
in marriage to okay uh, let's say talk about it is let's talk about the women first yeah? because mm-hmm. we're not talk about the men here mm-hmm. so i'm going to read again marry not the women who associate others with allah in his divinity mm-hmm. until they believe for a believing slave girl is better than a woman who associates others with uh, allah in his divinity he's talking about the comparison he's not talking about period he said for my friend what comparison it says don't marry and believe in women don't marry don't marry don't marry don't marry yeah. yes so you cannot marry it's forbidden for you to but marry have, a woman she is not a believing woman do you agree i have to finish the whole verses and you know, because if you finish the verse then you might understand what exactly he's saying my friend do you want us to go to al maudud your favorite book are you going to go to interpretation my friend do you want me to go to al maudud your favorite this book? Is, this is maududi i'm reading okay you are reading al maududi yeah, yeah yeah in my okay hold on let us go to al maududi all right yeah Okay, but, uh, let, let us see the interpretation uh, of Al Maududi, my friend. Go, hold, hold on. Yeah. Okay. All right. Don't marry a mushrik woman unless they believe. Do you see it? Yes. Okay. Uh, sorry, I'm not on. Uh, this is Al Maududi. Did you put it? No. It's in the screen. No, in your screen is still chapter five verse. Okay. Let me let me give it to you in the in the chat. No problem. And you are the one, remember, you are the one who said, if this is true, this is a contradiction. Yeah, if, if Quran one place says you can marry them and the other place says you can't marry them, Thank of you. course, it, right. it appears like a contradiction. Yes. That's wonderful. Yes, and I believe Quran has not a single contradiction. Okay, well, let us see. Just trying to see the context. I can't see still in the screen. Hello? I am here, I'm listening, my friend. I'm giving you time to talk and to read. Oh, oh I thought you... No, but there's nothing on the screen actually. I but gave you, I gave you the link. I get, I'm showing on the screen here. Don't marry a mushrik woman unless they believe. A slave woman who believe is better than a free woman who does not believe. The mm. Quran is so clear, and you are the one who said, and everybody heard you. If one verse saying you can marry a mushrik woman, and one verse saying marry a mushrik woman, that is a clear contradiction. So ah, are you are you okay. going to keep are you going to keep your promise? Subhanallah. 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 Go ahead. No. Yeah, yeah, I, 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 you, you make when you say something, mm. it makes the word so clear for me. Subhanallah. Subhanallah. Because here, um, my friend, my mm-hmm. friend, uh-huh. here the word used in Arabic is mushrikat. Ah. Mushrik over there uses ahl kitab. Ah. So when Allah say mushrik, Allah is not talking about ah. ahl kitab here. Uh, okay, so but is, is, the, is the Christian Mushrikeen, my friend? Is the, is, the Christian is, women and the, 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 the well, mush- let me say something. Okay, let me, let me ask you. Let me ask you. Is the Christians? Is the Christian Mushrikeen? I don't don't use my words for that. Allah addressed them as Ahl Kitab. My friend, my friend, no, Ahlul Kitab. Listen, Ahlul Kitab. In the time of Muhammad, you are the one who said to me before that. Oh, do you know that Muhammad here maybe is talking about people who exist before him? They will go to heaven. So now he's saying to you that people of the book. They are the one who say that the son of Allah is Uzair. Those are the Jews. And the son of Allah is Jesus. Are they mushrik based on this? Did Allah, did Allah call uh, Ahl Kitab mushrik? Are you waiting for me to answer or not? No, no, no. But what I'm saying is... I will let you answer. Verse, I will let you answer first. Okay. Look, can I let you... Can I allow you? I give you... Um, um, I allow you to read normally what you do. My friend, no, to, no, don't allow me. Don't, no, no, don't allow me. I want you to tell me. Is the Christians and the Jews mushrikeen? Yes or no? This this verse is not talking. My about friend, Christians. no. This, I'm asking you a direct question. About, I'm asking you a direct question. Be honest. Is the Christian and the Jews, according to your knowledge, according to Islam, are they are they mushrikeen? Uh, definitely, Jews are not. The Jews are not. Why? They're not. They don't do shirk. Why? The Jews the Jews don't do shirk. What, what shirk mean? Do you know? Jews believe, Jews believe is just in one God. They they don't do shirk. So they don't, anyone he say don't okay let me ask you a question anyone says that Jews are mushrikeen he is a stupid liar correct if anybody says Jews are mushrikeen a uh, stupid liar I wouldn't say that well, I, but I, I'm just saying that you prove me prove me wrong no why you don't say that if you are if you are sure are you sure or not is the Jews mushrikeen yes or no well when I'm saying is I'm saying into my own limited knowledge prove okay, me wrong okay here we go the Quran my friend says that the Christians and the Jews the Christian they say that Jesus is the son of Allah and, yeah? and, the Jews, and the Jews, and the Jews, they say, and the Jews, they say, Uzair is the son of Allah. So, mm-hmm. are they mushrikeen or not? Okay, of course not. So, if somebody says that uh, he, he have a son of Allah, he is not mushrik. Yeah, well, listen, 
uh, Jews still believe many the son of uh, son of God. You know that Adam, David. <laughs> No, Adam, my friend, David, my friend, no, no, listen, listen. No, no. It says the, the Jews, Jews, the Jews Jesus. call Uzair the son of Allah, and the Christians call the, the Christ the son of Allah. So this is what it's meant about naming a person. He is the only one is the son of Allah. This is what the Quran is saying. Who's the one? They take the rabbis and uh, which verse is 930 or 9 Chapter 9, verse number 30. And yeah, then the even, Jews say Ezra hmm. is Allah's son. And the Christians say the Messiah is the son of Allah. Hmm. These are merely verbal assertions in imitation of the saints hmm. of those unbelievers who preceded them. Hmm. May Allah ruin them. Hmm. So, okay, son of Allah, Jews say, uh, Jews say many of son of Allah, son hmm. of God. Hmm. So that doesn't mean they worship them. Really? Jews never worship anybody. Okay, they, should they we go? Never, to, uh, should, never should we Jews go? Worshiping okay, thank you. You remind me of, uh, of uh, Hijab when he said, for 4,000 years, Four thousand years, not even a single Jew broke the command which is instructed them to worship one God. Four thousand years. So now you are confirming that your prophet is a liar. Thank you very much. Because this okay. verse, my friend, let us go to Al Maududi. Can we go to Al Maududi, your, your favorite friend? Which verse? Al Maududi, chapter 9, verse yeah. number 30. Okay, let us go okay. to Al Maududi. I like Al Maududi. Yeah, from, from now on, from now and from now on, okay, Al Maududi. The my, years. my friend, I like Al Maududi. I love Al Maududi. Let us see what Al Maududi is saying. Here we go. Yeah, yeah. Okay, Mr. Al Maududi. Mm -hmm. But uh, can I say something? My friend, you? don't forget, please, after you finish this, uh, you know, to download the video and post it in YouTube, your YouTube. Okay, yeah. don't forget. Yeah. Can, All right. Can I say something? Do you promise me? Do you promise me you will post it in your YouTube? My YouTube. Yes. Well, I don't have a YouTube channel. You are a speaker corner, but you don't have a YouTube channel. I couldn't care less about the YouTube channel. So okay, no, do you promise me to open a YouTube point. channel and and pause this video because this is a victory for you? Remember, the Jews they say Ezra, by the way, it doesn't say Ezra, it says Uzair, is the son of Allah, and the Christians say the Messiah is the son of Allah. All right, now I want you to read for me the interpretation. What is what is the interpretation? Can I say before I was going to say something before? Yeah, go Can ahead. I say something. Go ahead. You never you never allow me to ask. Uh, when I started this conversation. I said to you, uh, Quran, I, I do not believe any commentary is infallible. You remember that I said that to you? Okay, aren't you the one who yeah. chose for me the Al, -Al Maududi? No, 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 no. I was not choosing any. You just asked me, okay, choose, choose, choose one. Give me one, one, one. So I say, okay, I'll give you one. But what I said to you in the beginning. So now Al Maududi is bad person. Al Maududi is not good. Okay, Al Maududi is not good. I'm not saying that. Okay, let's go to the Quran. Okay, okay, no problem, no problem, guys. Al Maududi is bad. He's a he's a donkey. Okay, 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 no problem. Let me ask you. Let me ask you. Okay, does it say there? Does it say there? From the very beginning, I said, my friend, the commentaries are not infallible. Okay, no problem. Let us see. What that means? Okay, I want you to explain the Quran for me. It says it says they worship, they associate with him. Do you see that? In the Quran, not not the interpretation, they associate with Allah. Does it say that? Uh, this Messiah, the Son of Allah. These are merely verbal assertions in imitation of saying of the those who unbelievers who preceded them. Hmm. It doesn't say that. It says here in front of me they associate with Him. The Quran says that. Chapter nine, verse thirty. What's the Arabic of that? No, not not, not thirty only. You have to read the verses after it. Read with me. You see here. Uh, actually, even even here, even here it says, uh, read verse thirty. Uh, okay, uh, read. If you if you go if you continue reading the verse after it, verse number thirty one says, okay. they take their priests and their uh, 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 rabbis as their lord in the regression of Allah, and they been but yet they were command to worship Allah alone, and he and he you know he's saying praise and glory for him for he is, uh, etc., that you cannot have a, wor a worship or partner with him. So the verse is accusing them that they are taking partner and association with Allah. So they are mushrikeen. No, you're wrong. No, okay. Let me get you, Master. You okay, hold on. That's fine. Let me, let me, allow me to, 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 to get you, uh, uh, I'm not, I'm not, uh, I'm not insulting you. Just, no, no, it's no, a, you it's can, a word. You can. I don't take it as insult. Yeah, I don't this okay. is your habit. That's no uh, problem. You uh, can say it. You know what? In speakers, going to people say worse things than that. Trust me. Okay. I'm I'm not concerned about me. What I'm concerned is when you you say bad things about the Prophet and Allah. That's mm -hmm. what I'm more concerned about. You can say whatever names you want to say. I have a quite a thick skin. Trust me. Okay. No problem. But, but I was asking you a question just for the sake of fun. Are I are you, are you slave? Are you Abdul? No, I'm not. Thank God. I'm so can I call you Abdul Filin Kar? I am not. How you can call me that? I am not a Muslim, my friend. No, Abdul who's in denial. Is that what Abdul Filin Kar? Can I call you that? Abdul what? Abdul Fil Inkar. 
the one who's denied. I, ne- I never heard of such an Arabic before. Your Arabic is wonderful. <laughs> what is that? Okay, I thought he said the Abdul who's in denial. So okay, maybe I'm wrong. No, no, my friend yeah. Abdul Abdul is somebody he considers himself a slave of Allah. All right. Okay. I do let consider us, myself. Okay. Let us see. Let us see. Right. The Quran says, "لقد كفر الذين قالوا أن المسيح هو الله." Those who say the Messiah is Allah, they are kuffar. What verse you read? Explain to me how that happened. If you are not mushrikeen according to you. What verse did you read? Oh, hold on. I just want to see the verse what you're reading. Because I just, this one uh, verse, uh, what you reported not... earlier about you cannot marry mushrikeen. I'm sorry, you were wrong. It was not Ali Kitab. It was talking about the pagan mushrik. And if you read any commentary, mm. I'm sitting here right now. I'm not, I'm, I'm just saying it openly, read that. Uh, that the, the, you cannot marry Mushrik women. That's not talking about the Jews and the Christians. I can assure you, even you open Ibn Abbas if you want to. Okay. Do you uh, do you like us to go to any interpretation you wish? To, yeah, yeah. to assure no, me? Me wish. Me wish. You wish. No, no, you wish. I you want wish. you to. I want you to repeat, pick up any interpretation. Okay. Actually, normally you like Ibn Abbas, don't you? You okay. uh, pick up Ibn Abbas and tell me about. It says you cannot marry Mushrik women. It is talking about Jews and Christians. Even okay. I let you read that interpretation. Normally, I say I'm skeptic about interpretation. No Let's problem. Okay. Interpretation. okay, hold on. Hold Any on. interpretation. No problem. Here this is go. my confidence on that. That is not talking about Jews and Christians. Okay, no problem. <clears throat> and I told you that that will be a contradiction. And I, I, I'm not shy of that because I'm a believer in the Quran. Quran says there's no contradiction in it. And I believe in it 100%. No problem. So that's why uh, that's why I say openly yes, but that is not a contradiction. That's talking about Mushrikeen. No problem. The other was talking about Ahli Kitab. It's no different. problem, my friend. Give me a second. Eh, this website sometime. Can you tell me which verse we're looking for? Hold on, hold on. No, I do not need you to help me. It's in the front. No, no, no. Me. I didn't ask you. I say what verse we're looking for. I just want to see so I can prepare myself for who you're going to You read. are the one who asked me to read it, right? I mean, you do not know what verse Chapter 9, are. verse 31. Okay. Is it? Hmm. You are the one who's asking me. You do not know what I'm talking about, my friend. Um, chapter, I think, three twenty-eight. You said, chapter two, verse number two to one. And you okay. said, you said any interpretation, it's fine for you, right? Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Okay. <laughs> You're trying your best to find the interpretation which agrees with you. No, I just, I, 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 you, you see, you see, uh, my friend. We're not kids. I just ask you which one you want, and I will show it to you. You know. Let's see what Ibn Abbas says that you like. What that. about Al Maududi? Don't you want Al Maududi no more? You don't want. You don't want. You don't want. You don't want Al Maududi. We can go, go to. Okay, okay. Yeah. Commentary of Maududi. I have it with me. You want me to read it? All right. Here we go. Let us go to Al Maududi. As long yeah. as you like Al Maududi. Go. Go ahead. Read. Yeah. Go ahead. Okay. Okay. Chapter two, verse two twenty one, and uh -huh. uh, the commentary of that is: This is the reason for and the wisdom underlying the injunction mentioned above prohibiting marriage links with polytheists. Mm-hmm. Subhanallah. Subhanallah. Who, who is the policy? Yes. Christians and Jews are not polytheists. Not according to the, the not? spirit. Okay. Not according to the spirit of the Quran. Quran called them Ahli Kitab. Polytheists are those Arab pagans. Okay. They were the polytheists. Okay. That's wonderful. Marriage does not consist merely of sexual relations mm. between a man so and a woman. Believing, so believing in the Trinity will not make you polytheist, right? Oh, I say how Quran addressed. Quran. I'm asking you, I'm asking you. If, I believe, them in the if I believe in the Quran Trinity, in the uh, if I believe in the Trinity, does it make me a person who believe in Tawheed or a person who believe in polythe a, a polytheist? Uh, well, I'm going to even give you better what you like me to say. I'm going to give you what you actually like me to say. You are doing a shirk. Thank you very much. So here yeah. the verse saying, the verse saying, let thank you mushrikat. But what did I say earlier? Quran put uh, <laughs> a, a, a different boxes of people. What boxes? Are, you just said the Christians are mushrikeen. The verse in the front you, of me, you, you just Quran, said, you just said, you Quran just said. Did not say, Quran did not address them that. Quran addressed them as Ali uh, Kitab. Are you sure? Yes. Mm. Quran addressed them as Ali Kitab. Mary, okay. okay, anyway, I was reading the commentary. Did you, you didn't like the commentary? It says polytheists. My you friend, say Jews and Christians. My friend, so if, now I need to show you in the Quran where it says we are kuffar, right? No, 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 no. You need to show me the verse. Okay, what kuffar mean? What kuffar mean? Chapter two. Does kuffar mean? Does kuf, does kuffar mean polytheist? Does kuffar mean that we are polytheist? Yes or no? I you ask. No, answer me. Don't don't look. No, 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 no. Do you do you? Do you no, do you agree or you didn't agree that 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 the, the 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 word polytheist is fit with the Christians in Islam? Yes or no? 
According to the Quran, Christians are not polytheists. Okay, so okay. if so I sh if I show you a verse, if I show you a verse now, yeah, uh, remember everything with the context, yeah. Right. Sure. No problem. Okay, but again and again in this commentary about the polytheists, no never say no, Christians no and no Jews. No problem. No problem. No problem. Okay. Let us see. If the Quran. Okay, first, first thing first. Okay, yeah, let us go. Let us go. No, no, no. CP yeah. first thing first. Hold on. Hold on. You go to chapter write. five. Go to chapter well, CP, five. CP, go to chapter CP, five. CP, it doesn't work like that. CP. No, it like, worked like that. Let us go. We have to. We have to clarify one thing for sure. For ah, uh, you, you see, not, you receive. You, a did you receive a text from somebody? And this is why you rushed. Now you want to try to fix it. For me. No. Yeah. Well, so what? You just say no. that if I believe, if I believe in the Trinity, that will not make me much right. Everybody I'm heard keep, you. I'm keep telling you something. You, you just are, said everybody you heard you. Are, if you I if I believe the Trinity, that will not make me a much right. You said that. You yes are, or no? You are mixing a lot of. My things. friend, let's, did let's you? Okay, here you read with me. This is Al Maududi. This is the problem. This is Al Maududi. This is Al Maududi. It's almost certainly, most certainly, they committed a blasphemy. Listen, listen, you because see, you see, everything. Abdul, all Ab everything. hold on, you are the one who asked me for Al Maududi. This is it, this is the no, chapter I have five. Right to say my opinion. This I is a right chapter, to... okay, go, don't, don't, don't call me again, please. Let your dad call me. I'm done with you. I gave you a chance.